CIA customs the cars to control Hey guys, welcome to Die Customs. Uh, today we're actually going to show you all of the controllers we've done so far. Uh, this first one is a uh, digital camo. It's the snow digital camo. And um, it's actually a hydro dip. We didn't paint this, it's hydro dipped. Um, and um, all of these controllers that we're going to show you, we can actually do um, and sell. And uh, I mean, we'll give you a, a pretty good deal on them. So, hydro dip's a little bit more expensive. Just because we actually don't do the hydro dip ourselves, we actually have to have someone else do it because we don't have the machine. But um, it, the hydro dip just feels amazing, looks perfect. Um, blue LEDs, obviously, we can do any color of LEDs. Um, and uh, that's that first controller. So um, that's actually my personal controller. This is Shibby's personal controller. And uh, it's a red skull. Uh, this is also a hydro dip. Um, we did red buttons, thumbsticks. You know, it has red LEDs, um, see-through red back, part of the front see-through red, and then we also did some gloss to kind of match the gloss black in the in the hydro dip. Um, as you can tell, though, the detail in those skulls is just amazing. So. Um, we can do that as well, and then we also have. There's also other hydro dips. We just haven't had them done yet, by the way. But uh, there's a ton of hydro dips. If you have an idea, they probably have a dip for it already, or we can paint it. Um, this is a green zombies hydro dip. This is the last hydro dip that we've had done. Um, this one's actually still for sale. Uh, PM us if you want it, or shoot us an email. I'll leave the Dia Customs email in the information below. Um, and uh, this controller is awesome as well. Uh, we actually, what we did was we left the LEDs green. So normally we change the LED colors, um, but this time we just left them the, the green Microsoft because the controller is green, and it worked out real well. Um, as you can see, we did some gloss black, but we also did some clear black, so the smoked black. So there's smoked black on the d-pad and on the buttons um, and then there's the green LEDs uh, so that's that controller um, next we're gonna go to all the painted controllers um, this is our first painting controller uh, we did it for our friend his gamer tags Sharder Flynn and this was his birthday controller we made him a birthday controller uh, we can do the same type of controller we would we could even change colors we could change uh, we'll change the you know obviously to the name to your gamer tag on there um, we could put different pictures on the back all sorts of stuff like that but I love the two ladies on there that's it's it just fits uh, Charter perfectly um, and then the skull with the crown and uh, DIA at the bottom of it that's our clan tag is DIA and then some see-through stuff on there and, um, and then bullet buttons obviously bullet d-pad bullet guide button which was awesome I thought and then what we did on the LEDs for this one was we did uh, alternating white and red, white, red, white, red. Um, and they just look amazing. We also did that on the, the next controller we're going to show, um, which is our Resident Evil controller. As you can see, it has blood thumbprints and fingerprints everywhere. We did some bullet buttons on that, different color though. These are the silver Luger bullet buttons. Then we also have scratch marks on the side. And um, then we did the same thing with the LEDs. We did the white, red, white, red um, to look like the umbrella symbol, you know? And um, we actually left the Xbox guide button chrome. Um, but uh, this controller, we can remake this controller and uh, sell it if you want something, you know, similar, maybe a little different, maybe a little less um, thumb and fingerprints or something. Or instead of bullet buttons, you want other buttons. We can do that as well. Um, this one's actually already sold and the person already has it I love the RE on the back there just oh it's perfect and um but we can recreate this and uh we'd be happy to do so just you know like I said shoot us PM or email us and we'll give you some details on how much it'll cost um and then there's the uh LEDs again okay this next one um 
we can do this one. I doubt anybody will want this simply for the fact that it was made personally for me, Houdini. Um, I'm a huge Superman fan, so we have the Superman symbols on it. And then it also has my gamer tag on it. What we did is we got um, a clear blue controller case and we um, painted around that with the it's it's silver color but I wanted it to look like a metal of some sort you know because of the Man of Steel um, and then I just put bits and pieces of different uh, parts I had ordered I had ordered because uh, I wanted it to be red and blue themed you know then you can see it has Houdini on there and then the clan symbol on the bottom DIA and then um, the crown symbol on the back that we like to use and then there's the cracked symbol slash lightning symbol, whatever you want to call it, um, all around the controller. It goes all around the controller, and it looks like it's, you know, stemming from the guide button. It's what we kind of tried to do. And uh, it goes to the symbols. And, um, uh, you know, it is a great controller. Um, still have it. If you want something similar, we can do that as well, you know. So, um that's that for that one. Oh, 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 it lights up blue, 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 and as you can see, some of the LEDs kind of go through a little bit because uh, it's clear. Mm. I actually thought about making it red, but I decided to stay with blue on that one. This um, is actually probably my favorite controller we've done. Uh, next to the, I still like the Sharder Flynn one, but this one's my favorite because I'm a huge, I, I'm a huge Superman fan, but I'm also a big uh, Punisher fan, and so, uh, we we did this flat black, um, and we can definitely recreate and sell this. We could even add your gamer tag on there if you want somewhere, and we'd even let you choose the spot. Um, you know, it says it's not revenge on this side, and then on the other side, it's gonna say it's punishment. So what we do, you know, we did the white and black the Punisher theme. We could even change the colors if you wanted to do like red and black for Punisher, um, or something like that. We just do white and black because those are the main colors you know um and then we did the uh skull puncher skull in the black back it's the bleeding puncher skull is what it's called and uh, that's the battery pack um this controller <laughs> I, we still have this currently in talks with somebody who wants to buy it uh willing to willing to sell it to him um but you know if somebody else wants one we can definitely recreate it we could even change colors white leds around the bolt hole right there um, um, that's about it, guys. That's all the controllers we've made so far. We I left out one. We did a PS3 version of the Resident Evil controller, but I just left that out um, because I, you didn't need to see two of the same type of controller. It was just on a PS3 version. Uh, and that's about it, guys. If you want to order or even just talk about ordering, get prices, anything like that, email us or PM us, and we'll give that to you. So enjoy. Peace.